How's it going, Chicks mates? This is Mr. Charles, and we're here with a game called When the Past Was Around. Okay, I've gone through some game job games recently. Um, I was less than impressed with them, and I was nearly going to resort to the PlayStation or something on there, and then I saw this, and something about this game, despite being an RPG, it's not scary, apparently. It is only a demo, but something about this game looks very... I don't know... It's not only professional, it looks really cute and meaningful and lovely and opening up your heart to something, which, which you know, I think I need. I don't think I need horror. I don't need to, to scare people and scare myself. I need to open up my emotions. So, I'm going to try to get through this demo. I want to know what it's kind of like. Um, I guess in a sense, I'm just going to like support the creator with this. Uh, I don't know what it's about. I don't know what's going to happen. Um, I've seen a few images and that's about it. So... Let's get into this, shall we? Uh, okay, but how do you start the game? Oh, hello. Uh, open you up. Hello, friend. Can I give you a hug? Uh, oh, okay, you can spawn doors. Let's go through the door together, friend. I'm sure I can trust a tall, dark stranger. Oh, look at us. We are holding hands. It's adorable. Okay. So, I hear this is a puzzle game, which <laughs> I have a bad history with those. I mean, it's a bit like Cube Escape, this, except a little more, um, a little prettier? This is actually really pretty. Okay. Keys, cool. Shoes. I'll just rearrange those. More shoes. Yes, I must clean the house. Those kids just going everywhere, messing up my house. I should really give them a smacked bottom. But I love them too much. Um, more keys. Uh, ooh, I can scroll the screen. That's nice. Uh, rearrange the chair. Uh, shall I? Uh, that carpet's out of place. Can't seem to do anything with it, though. I guess it's just going to stay there. Uh, some boxes. This is nice. Uh, can't really do anything with them, though. Just... <laughs> I think I've turned the boxes into a drum set now. All right, cool. Um... I can look in here. Uh, what's in this drawer? Absolutely nothing. Cool. Uh, what's in? Oh, I can't. I need a key for that. Fine. Okay. So can't do much there. <gasps> More boxes. Yes, please. Uh, question mark. Okay. Oh wait. Hold on. I have keys. <laughs> Why did I just wander away from it, thinking, "Oh, I don't have a key yet." All right. Well, what's in? What's in my drawer? Uh, ooh, a picture with me and someone. But that person's face has been ripped off. Are we angry with them? Are we sad with them? Did they die? I hope they didn't do anything too mean to us. I hope we can find forgiveness. Uh, I can't click away. Oh, okay, fine. I just have to click away from the screen entirely. Fine. Um, let's go into this person's drawer. I mean, I am invading someone else's personal property. But this is a game. <laughs> they don't have any personal property. They are NPCs. Alright, what we got here? We got a stick of gum? A gun? A, a scrapey thing? Seriously, what the hell is that? Okay, cool. Oh, is it to open the boxes? Why don't we just use our hands? Oh, do we need to use the boxes for the next time we move out of the house? That's not going to happen, I don't think. Because we have the main problem of, you know, this game's going to happen in this house and then it's we're probably just going to stay here. Unless the story develops that way. But we're not going to see it develop that way yet. Okay, so I got... Feather. Now, what can I do with that feather? Ooh, ooh, a cutscene. Here you go, my dear. I gave you a feather. Oh, thank you. And now I'm going to wear a cloak, just like you. All right. If you can make objects appear out of nowhere, can you just get us a winning lottery ticket? Oh, through the next door. But we haven't even looked inside what these boxes are. We just played them like the drums. Okay, in we go. Oh, this is nice as well. Is this the kitchen? Is this a... Oh, actual drums! Fancy that. I don't know what this room is. It's not a bedroom because there's no beds, I don't think. I don't think. No, there's no beds. Is this meant to be the living room? What was the room before then? Oh, okay. I'm, I'm looking into this too much. But this is a lovely home. And I have to admit, as someone who draws myself, not amazingly, I'm just trying to write a graphic novel now. But as someone who draws myself... This is qualified. Look at the details. Look at those piano keys. 
Look at the inside of that piano. Now, I could do the piano keys, but the inside of that piano, I don't know where I'd begin. Look at those jars. Look at those leaves, they're different colors. God, I wish I could draw a plant pot like that. All right, I'm getting a bit carried away. I am an artiste, so can you blame me? All right, drums. They sound so adorable. Uh, another key, cool. More drums. So I've got a key now. Oh, oh, this looks like a puzzle coming along. Great. Wonder if I can play a uh, Moonlight Serenade. Is that what they call it? Okay, well I'm not gonna try because one thing I'm not is a musician. I suck at music. Uh, I've got an owl. Um, excuse me, excuse me, my husband. I imagine you're my husband. Would you like an owl? Would you like a key? Okay, what's this then? Oh, well this will clearly go in here. Yay! What have we got? Nice jewelry box. Uh, oh, okay, another key. Can it play a nice little rhythm? Oh, okay, I need something else. Okay, all right, fine. What's this? Uh... Oh, hold on. Is this meant to be... This is the keys you need for the piano, so... Square, heart... Square, heart, oval, star... Flower, circle, triangle. Okay, first time lucky. So... Where's the square? Square... Heart, oval, star. Wait, square, heart, oval, star, flower, square. Oh, did I not do the square first? Square, heart, oval, star. Yeah, that, that's a square. There's nothing else here. Square, heart, oval, star, petal, circle, triangle. That's the exact order. Okay, well, I don't think randomly pressing keys is going to help. Alright, there's nothing else I can do here. What's this? It's a... Oh, do I have to tune the piano? Oh, no, hold on. That's for the... That's for this thing, isn't it? Yes! What have we got in here? Uh... I don't know what that is. Uh, mess up books. I just cleaned this living room. 1434641. Is that going to be for the piano? Oh, okay. Uh, I'm sure I'm going to look forward to finding all these pieces. Um, so I can't go in there, obviously. I'm missing a mirror. Uh, can't select anything here. Okay, 1434641. Oh, okay. Well, how come those the... Oh, right, it was telling me, oh, yeah, this is 1 to 7, fine. Um, I mean, I easily figured that out myself, but whatever. Oh, and there's another random piece here. Good old jars, they'd never let me down. All right, so is that all the pieces? It's a lot of the pieces. I do like how far away it looks like there's nothing in there. But when I zoom in, you know, there is some stuff in there. It's a very good um, illusion there, game designer. I'm not saying that's a bad thing, you know, I forgive it. It's just, you know, when you're developing, if you... Yeah. Um, right, a feather. So I'm giving my boyfriend another feather. Here you are, friend. Uh, do you want to become an owl? A pigeon? A duck? Oh, you want to be an owl? I'll accept that. I don't know why you need to wear clothes, but that's fine. I love you for who you are. Also, how do you have arms and legs? Because, like, owls don't have those, do they? Or are they, like, attachments they can get now? Is this owl a bionicle? All right, we're just going through here then. We're not going to question that. All right. Oh, <laughs> that's adorable. Look at them. The owl's going to sleep, even though it looks kind of um, duskish. And we're just reading a lovely book. But we look a little troubled. I wonder why that is. All right, fine. Well, we've got more puzzles here. I broke my plant pot. I also don't know how to say plant pot now for some reason. Um something here. Do I time it? I don't think I want to lose my hand, thanks. This is a really nice place that I'm just breaking all the plant pots. Why is it like at the first part of the game, we're just like, oh yeah, I'm going to tidy my place. And then after the first room, we're just like, oh, I'm going to break my plant pots. I'm going to throw my books everywhere. I don't care about my house. But it's such a nice house. I'd, I'd want to look after this house. I'd like to... <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? I don't even hoover my own room. I don't hoover my own room. I only make my bed when I'm doing a let's play. 
Like, all the priorities. Um. Okay. I think I'm making some food for my owl friend. Don't know why. I need a key. What the hell is that? Is that a sponge? Okay, we got a dirty sponge that we found in the plant pot. Oh, just break even more plant pots. We're very desperate. Oh, there's another one. My poor plants. My friends are being <laughs> broken apart. I mean, come on. Like, we've got to look after our environment, guys. You see this plant pot? Gone. You, feel, you see this one? It's gone. We don't need them. Oh, but this one's fine. The one on the table is the High Lord of Plants. It's the High Lord of Plant Pots. Oh, okay. Right, we have to do something with a plate. Certainly a lot to take in-game. Oh, <laughs> great. So you have to stop the fan. I don't know why I didn't figure that before. All right, so can I put anything in the blender? No. Can I... Oh, right, okay, hold on. The clock thing makes sense, because that'll just be a handle there. So add that. I think we need the hour hand as well. Hmm, i got to admit. Okay, so this game is actually getting a little challenging now. That's a that's a good sign. That's a sign of a healthy game. Uh, it's saying I can do something with this. Oh, wait, do I have to clean it with the... This? Oh, maybe I need to rinse it under a tap first, but the tap doesn't have a handle. Oh, very clever, very quaint, very droll game. Thank you. Right, run some water. Some very nice water. Oh, nice and soapy. That's always good. Hooray! 1915. I'm still missing my hour hand. Uh, there's a box here. And I can do something with it because there's a question mark over it. Uh, hubby, husband, do you have a little hand on you? All right, well, there's nothing there. And I can't seem to select anything else. I've got to leave something for the... Oh, wait, there's still this thing, isn't there? But I can't activate it. Do I have to pour something in? Oh, it's not plugged in. I'm an idiot. There we go. Okay, and then I leave it for the birds. Oh, and the bird has a letter for me. <laughs> Did I just bribe a bird to give me back my, my hour hand? All right, cool. We're not going to question why why a bird did that. Oh, very, very quaint, this game. It's adorable. I don't even care that a bird stole my um, hour hand. Right. And now we've got a crowbar. Do you want this, my owl friend? No, that's all right. Do, do you want this, my wife? I suppose I'm the wife, aren't I? Oh, right. The crate. Duh. Uh, am I going to have a feather? Oh, no, it's a little bolt. Or a key. Oh, wait, there's a... Isn't, wasn't there a thing that we had to open that was locked? Oh, our diary, I think. I think? <laughs> Dear diary, I married an owl. Oh. Or music? Oh, or a feather. Yay! Hey, husband, I have a present for you. This will give you your clothes back. Or maybe your violin. Oh, okay, your violin. Well... You're still wearing black, I'm sorry. We'll get you some nice, uh, I don't know, blue jeans, a Primark shirt. All right, what have we got over here? Um, yes, please, in we go. No, the music's changing. Oh, we're gonna watch our owl perform. This will be nice. I th okay, cool, so is that? Oh, he's got a little animation. He does look really cool, and we seem into him. He's playing little notes for us, and we're just staring absentmindedly, like not even blinking, just looking straight at those notes. Are those plants flowering because of us? They shouldn't be. We wrecked, like, all of them in the house. There shouldn't be any plants left. Um, do, do I click? Do I let him play to his heart's content? Oh, I take the notes. Yum, yum, yum. Very nutritious. No, they're mine. They're... Oh, <laughs> I just got knocked out by the sleep. Thank you, Mr. Owl. I'm still taking these notes, though. Give me more notes, Mr. Owl. Give... Oh, wow, I'm really passed out now. Can I drag the notes? No, I'm just stealing all the notes. Mine. Mine. 
You can be an owl, I'm a seagull. Oh, now I'm floating. That's... <laughs> that's convenient and a little dangerous. I must be careful of that. And... Oh, there we go. Now the owl's gone, and... Now the owl is drawing me in. <laughs> and the owl is also invisible. We're just going to accept that's part of the game now. Oh, and now we're going to steal from our owl friend. Uh... Okay, this music got... And then we exploded. Okay, I didn't expect that from the game. We're not dead, are we? <laughs> that would be awkward. Oh, uh, well, we look dead. We look dead or we look like we've just had great sex. I'm going to go with dead. Oh, uh, wakey, wakey. Uh, okay, I guess it was the latter. And in we go. Oh, that was lovely. Yay. And then the girl settled down with the owl. Uh, the, <laughs> of course, it was made by a team of owls. And then they lived happily ever after. Wow. Oh, thank you, game. Thank you for thanking me. That's very nice of you. Um, wow, that was actually really cool. Oh, and you get a little picture of the owl. Oh, he seems happy. Gotta say, actually, when I was going on Game Drop recently, it seemed like all the good games were gone. Like, it's, it's been years since anything good has been on there. But this game, like, I know it's not going to be like a AAA or Call of Duty Modern Warfare, but... It was really nice and heartwarming. And there's not many games that actually try to be really nice and heartwarming. I don't know where the story would go. I'm guessing by what happened with that violin thing, there's meant to be some kind of twist where it doesn't necessarily get horrific, but it gets kind of um, tangled. Is tangled the right word for it? But yeah, I can see that these people have got plans. I really, really hope they, they get through it. Like, they actually make the game and then put it on, I don't know, Steam or something, because this deserves to be up there. This is a really cool show-off, um, but you don't see many of these games actually, like, take off and do stuff. Normally, you see this, and then that's it, which would be really sad, but, you know, it's truly a brilliant game. I'm really looking forward to seeing if there's a sequel or anything, but if there's not, well, I had this experience, and it was lovely. Well, anyway, if you want to play the game for yourself, I'll leave a link to the Game Drop page in the description below. And without further ado... Look for the book, subscribe to the YouTube channel. Until next time, see ya.